Okay, so today we are gonna start our rainforest unit and we're gonna be creating rainforest layers. So there's a couple examples of some finished work. So today we're gonna to be doing the top and the bottom of your foreground and then um, obviously folding the paper. Um, this visual right here are different ideas with jungle leaves that you can add and we'll be using this today. So you'll have a couple of these per table. So first thing you're going to do is we're gonna write our name, Mrs. K, and our class code on there and then turn the paper over. So we have this tall paper for a reason because we're gonna do some folding. So let's start at the top. This is gonna be the emergent layer, so the very top layer. Um, so this top spot here, you're gonna fold it like two or three inches. And I kinda line up the edge a little bit, press that down. And then at the bottom, this is gonna be the understory of the foreground, the place closest to us. And I would fold this up about four, five inches. So make sure you get it to the edge. Okay, so this would be your paper. You have this top part, which is the emergent layer, and then the bottom, which is the understory, okay? So with this emergent layer, what you're gonna start off with this is going to be like the top canopy of the um, trees of the forest. So you can take a Sharpie. I'd start here and draw some curvy lines. Okay. If you prefer to start with um, pencil first, that's fine. And then you would cut that. And this bottom one here, we're going to draw some leaves. So this is where this will be come in handy. So you can have these banana leaves and leaves are organic so it doesn't have to be perfect okay so you're just going to get those leaves on here this one kind of has a heart shape to it this one's going to be on top so I'm going to erase I would suggest doing that erasing um, now because if you wait till the end then it becomes more difficult then we can have some more of these leaves coming up here. I'm gonna have leaves that go all the way to the edge here, because I'm gonna cut these out. I can have another one of these banana-like leaves. And then this back area, I can just kind of create some more of these repetitive lines for the leaves. You can get the idea. Drawing the leaves that's in the background and so on. So you want it to be full because it's a jungle. Then you're going to take your Sharpie and you're going to trace over all those leaves. And then eventually you will erase. But the main thing today is this top part here. You want it to look interesting. You don't want to leave it flat because if it's flat, it's gonna look um, not as interesting when we do the background and we keep layering it. So you wanna have this right here and then you're gonna cut along that top layer here. If you have something like this, you can cut all the way down in that and that's fine. Um, you should be fine doing that or you can kind of give it more of a bubble cut and that would be fine with me as well, okay? but layers and layers, and that will create some interesting textures onto your paper. And just keep um, adding more and more. So today, um, I'm hoping that you um, finish drawing the uh, emergent layer, which is this top part, top flap, the bottom with the um, leaves, and this is the understory. And then you should be able to cut out along this area and along that area today. 